Have you ever seen a tree that was weirder than putting jam on both sides of toast? Emma sure did. Every single day. In her backyard was a tree. The middle of the tree looked just like a tree. But if you looked up, you didn't really see a tree. You saw roots reaching for the sky. This tree was upside down. No one knew why the tree was upside down. Except for Emma's dad. He didn't tell anyone, but when he planted it, he put the seeds in upside down. But that's his secret, so please don't tell anyone. Emma's mom would have been very annoyed if she knew that dad planted the seed upside down. She had told him 47 times to make sure he plants the seed right side up. He obviously forgot his listening ears that day. Well, one summer day, Emma heard the strangest sound. She looked up at the roots on the top of the tree. She could not believe her eyes. Her pet, Rhinoceros Billy, was stuck up on the top of the tree. Now, Billy was always getting into trouble, but she had no idea how he got up there. Billy was not having the best time, even though he was laughing and laughing. The roots of the treetop were giving him a serious tickling, and Billy was super ticklish. He was racing around on the top of the tree, trying to escape the tickling roots. But the more he raced, the more he got tickled. The more he got tickled, the more he raced. His laughing got louder and louder. The windows in Emma's house began to shake. Billy was soon moving so fast that all Emma could see was a gray blur moving around in a little circle. All of a sudden, a root snapped. Emma shrieked as she saw her dear Billy fall through the roots towards the ground. He fell, and he fell, and he fell more. Faster and faster he sped towards the ground. Boom! Billy hit the ground. Emma's window shattered into pieces, but Emma didn't care. She was only worried about her precious Billy. But she couldn't see Billy anywhere. She ran towards the tree. There was a huge hole at the bottom of the tree. She looked into the hole. Billy was alive. He wasn't laughing anymore, but he was smiling. Emma reached her strongest arm down the hole and pulled Billy out. Emma's dad came racing out of the house, just as Emma pulled Billy out of the hole. What happened? And what is that smell? He asked. Emma explained what she had just seen, but she did not smell anything funnier than her dad. Dad peered over the edge of the hole. Hmm, very interesting, he murmured. But before Emma could ask, what is so interesting? Naughty Billy smacked his little tail and knocked Daddy so hard he fell into the hole. Emma laughed a little bit, but then quickly reached her strongest arm back into the hole and pulled her dad out. She noticed something crazy. Her dad was covered in applesauce. From head to toe, applesauce was everywhere. And how can that be? Well, as Billy fell and made that huge hole, his enormous body knocked off all the apples of the upside down tree and squished them all into applesauce and kids. Now you know how applesauce was invented. Now can you guess what they ate for dessert after dinner that night? The same thing everybody else on their street had that night. Applesauce. Wonderful, delicious applesauce.